just seen is screenshots from yesterday's five circle preview to summarize it it was a complete disaster parts of it looked really bad parts of it looked really unfinished and oh, this this is the best one there are literally untextured buildings the fact that this was allowed to be previewed is a massive ball ache and it's more of a ball ache than trying to commute on the central line during rush hour because if you're going to preview this, this, or even this, then we've got a big problem here. <sighs> Let me make this clear. I'm not here to insult Rivet Games. I'm sure that the route developers have tried their best with this route. And it seems to me like they were rushed to get this out before it was even ready. Really, the only positives that I have are with the modelling of the Class 170 and the Fort of Railbridge. I think they've done a decent job with both of them. That's just about as good as it gets. The physics are just okay, and the sounds need a bit of an improvement. They're not the worst sounds, but they're not great either. And timetable-wise, you only get 164 services, half of them being for the Turbo Star, and half of them being for the 385, which isn't even included with the route. And as much as I'm looking forward to the 158 for 5, which has been made by Skyhook, I don't think he's going to save this route at all. At the time of making this video, the route is scheduled to release on Tuesday for about 30 quid. Yeah, go figure. Will I review the route? I have no idea. I'm just tempted to make a review on this instead of the 5 circle because of how bad the preview was. Or I'll just pick it up, laugh at it, and then have a good day after that. Again, who knows? Oh, and Rivet, if you're going to speak like this on your own forums, then maybe you need a bit of a wake-up call. Anyway, that's all I have to say. Here's a picture of me next to my favourite train, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.